What's up everybody, it's The Offspring and this is Farming Simulator 2015 Mods. Today we have some cool, cool mods. Uh, I showed you guys some of these in my uh, previous hauling video and I said I would do uh, give the links and showcase everything in the mod video. So uh, with that, God, look at this thing guys. Tow truck. Been waiting so long for somebody to release a tow truck and Winston did it. Uh, it great I, I can't I can't even like I can't even it, it's just so cool uh, I believe everything works on it it allows you to actually tow and stuff on it so we're gonna try that out and uh, yeah guys we're gonna take this thing on a little drive test out handling and whatnot it's got the awesome cab on it I, I love this Kenworth my favorite semi and uh, I, I would actually like somebody to take this cab uh, well, this, you know, Kenworth that somebody released and, uh, you know, I guess make it into a semi. Because uh, the other one's a day cab. So it's got the warning lights on it. Warning flashers. Let's see. Whoa. Whoa. whoa, whoa. That's a lot of controls there. Holy, that's a lot of controls. Alright. Let's start at the top. L. Work light back. Alright. K. K. There's another work light. J, high beams. X, fog lights. B, light bar. Got some light bar lights. Alright. Let's see. Keypad 5. M. Got some supports. How to remove supports. Alright. Main boom down. Okay, so you don't control this thing with your mouse. You control it with the keypad. It's going to be a little bit hard. Um, I, I just like the mouse. It's a little bit more accurate. But hey, I ain't complaining. This thing is a beast. Really, really cool. And uh, yeah, guys, let's see. What can we do with this thing? Hmm. Alright. Second boom. Alright, so I guess you just extend everything out, oh the hood opens, check that, that's what the other one should have did, the other Kenworth, battery box, battery box isn't working, yeah battery box isn't working. Oh, nope, it's working. It only works on my mouse uh, buttons. Like, my mouse, my, my, I have a Razer Naga that has, like, buttons on it. But it, it just, it won't work on the keypad. Yeah, it won't work on the keypad. So, uh, load lock. All right. Let's go and get that uh, Kenworth. I mean, that uh, Ford truck over there. Try that on there. Because I already did kind of like a showcase on it last video when I used it. So, um, we don't really need to do too much on it. Interior, poop poop, but uh, truck itself is pretty good. Been needing a Ford semi truck, and I love Ford semi trucks. The texturing on it kind of messes up. It's like the the truck's like black but made out of chrome. All right, so I guess I just drive this thing up on it or something. I really don't understand how to work this thing. Or is it just, or is this tow truck just for show? There's no like locking on it. Like you can't hook up or nothing. <sighs> Let's see, load lock. I guess I'm gonna try load lock. All right. Okay, so I. So I guess all you do is uh. You just drive onto this little thing right here and then just lock the load. I, I, that's, I guess that's what you're supposed to do. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm guessing it seems to be that's what you're supposed to do. So let's uh, take all these supports. M. Z. Alright, we're off. Something's up. Because even though I'm hooked up to it, I can't turn. Well, I can turn, but 
does not turn <laughs> much at all. I mean, I'm guessing I'm doing the, the right thing. This is turning is not something you'd want to do with this thing. I really like it. This thing is awesome. We've been needing a tow truck, but I don't know. It might be for show or something, but I'm guessing I'm. This is the only way I can think of how it's supposed to work. Like literally, this is the only way I can think of how it's supposed to work. And with this, it goes like two miles an hour, and it pulls to the right. And uh, see, turning is just pain because the truck itself isn't like hooked up like how a trailer would be. You know, so it doesn't rotate or anything, so it's just really, really hard to turn. I don't know. It looks really good. It's just the actual using of the thing is kind of hard. Alright, I mean, maybe I'm supposed to raise the boom up a little bit more. Second boom unfold. Yeah, apparently that's what you're supposed to do, so main boom up. See it doesn't raise the thing up. It doesn't raise the actual track, you know, whatever you're pulling up. I don't know guys, I really don't know. I'm using my keyboard because there's a lot of controls guys, so sorry about the clicking, but I mean it's a mechanical gaming keyboard. I, I would not get any other keyboard besides a mechanical keyboard because they're the best for PC gaming. And um, yeah guys, so apologize on that, so I don't know. I'm guessing I'll just put it up like that. See, what the hell is that all about? See, now it's turning just a little bit better turn in a little bit better but it just drags it it just drags whatever vehicle you're using it just it just drags it that's pretty much I guess what it does it just it's a dragger I'm gonna call it instead of a tow truck I'm gonna call it a dragger so we're going a little bit faster now we're going 15 miles an hour but uh when you got that 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 truck or whatever you use on it it just drags it like literally like see how the tires on, on the vehicle that I'm hauling ain't moving it's just that's why it's going so slow and, and, it, and it sucks at turning because, you know, instead of like um, like that other tow truck, that tow truck truck, it hooks on like with attach, like with an attacher. So when you're driving, the, you know, you load and whatnot, you can turn it like a trailer, you know, the, the truck or car, whatever you're hauling with that tow truck, the, the tow truck Chevy or whatever it is, it, it, you know, the, it acts like a trailer, you know, how it's supposed to be on a tow truck, like a tow truck. You know, like the, the truck itself moves like it, as if it was a trailer, the tires, you know, move. So that's why this thing is going really slow and having problems because that's my guess on it is because it's just dragging it. I mean, this is probably a version one of uh, Winston's release, so I'm, I'm probably guessing there's probably going to be more versions of this truck released. And, um, I mean, tow trucks are kind of hard in this game, you know, because there's not really any, you know, engine or game, you know, physics or anything for a tow truck. But it's been done, and they work, you know what I mean, and they work, and I'm glad to have this thing, but it's just, it's it's really hard to use. Like, that's the problem. It's just, when it, it drags it, like, see, watch, I'm backing up, cut the wheel, there we go. It's just a, it's just a pain, I mean... It'd be cool for role-playing, role I guess you would say, but the whole 14 miles an hour top thing and it dragging the truck without, like, moving the things or the turning of it, 
it just pretty much adds a length onto this truck and this truck just drags whatever you're pulling I mean let me try it with a different vehicle and uh, and see how it works with a different vehicle but um but I'm pretty sure it's just the same you know what's going on so like let's say like uh, if we're doing a heavy rescue with this truck right here oh by the way guys we fixed the low boy um, I will be updating the links probably today or tomorrow for the uh, detaching on it we got the detaching to work for the low boy and uh, please guys do not upload this low boy anywhere else I saw it uploaded some some to some sites and uh, that kind of got some people aggravated and 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 whatnot and it got me aggravated too because I didn't like that at all um, that's why I like King Merc I heard that he removed all of his mods and a lot of modders did because of people not following rules and I agree with Phoenix in his last videos you know what I mean we're people are releasing mods and they don't have to you know they're not do making anything or anything for it or, or benefiting anything you know what I mean they're just making these mods for y'all and then some people just go around like dicks excuse my language and upload other people's work and that that sucks it's like you taking it's as if like somebody takes a song and makes that song say if I made a song and then somebody else comes and takes my song and uploads it to a website and uh, puts their name on it it'd be like me taking a Rihanna song and uh, and changing the it's, instead of having Rihanna it'd be Offspring Gaming you know what I mean? It'd be like Offspring Gaming Single Ladies. <laughs> you know what I mean? Or whatever. So, I don't really listen to pop, so I don't really know, but... Oh, crap. Yeah, but guys, I mean, just please, please do not upload any of the mods anywhere. Just keep them on the channel. You know, same with anybody's mods. Winston's mods, keep them on his website. Do not upload Winston's mods anywhere else, because when people do that, they ruin it for everybody. Like, they, they don't understand that. Like... They ruin it for everybody. Like now, Merc, really, pretty much one of the talent, most talented modders in the community right now, King Merc. You know what I mean? Just had his mods uploaded somewhere without permission, and he just took down all of his mods. And uh, I don't know if he's quit or not, but he said uh, he may come back. But he said he's just fed up with that, and I don't blame him at all because that's just stupid. I mean, whoever just takes a mod and, or like a private mod for instance takes a private mod makes a video on it or or uploads it to their website or tries to trade it it's private for a reason guys you know what I mean I don't I don't know I'm sorry for the rant guys I usually barely ever rant and I just saw that I was watching uh, Phoenix video and I saw, I saw him having the same problems and I'm having the same problems it's just I thought this was over. I thought the whole FS2K stealing and the mod stealing stuff was over. We were doing so good for a little bit, and then this happens when somebody takes and uploads the mod when they're not supposed to. Because, I mean, for us to release the mods, just keep them on the channel. That's all we asked for. And, uh, yeah, guys, I mean, we're taking, like I said, a little hiatus due to that kind of stuff, really. And we need a break. Um, Mason's just got some personal stuff he's dealing with. And, um, and yeah, guys, so... I mean, we, we're just taking a little, little hiatus, so let me, uh, load up, let me see, yeah, but, um, but yeah, we're just taking a little hiatus, and, um, I mean, is that breaks it, alright, we're done with this thing, we got this 8530 I did in the previous video, this thing is my favorite tractor, I love it so much. And uh, I have a problem. I was going to bring that the wheels to my farm on a forklift, but they sink into the ground to where you can't even get the pallet under them. So, um, yeah. I mean, we got it. Symbol twin wheels. There we go. It's like I think one of the, one, whoever, you know, has been uh, releasing or recreating Joe Lindbergh's mods I think made this because um, I really like it I appreciate whoever's doing that because I know Joe Lindbergh does not like to release his mods and uh, every time I go in his comments and stuff I mean it'd be like I, I mean people aggravate him and stuff they'll be like oh are you releasing your mods oh can you release this and he'd be like no 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 make it yourself make it yourself and I guess somebody just got you know fed up and they were like I guess we're not getting them so I'm, I'm gonna just make his mods if we can't get his mods so I mean, I really like them. I, I really wanted Joe's mods, and I'm glad somebody's been, you know, releasing them. So I really like that, because they're really, really good mods. 
Especially that Kenworth and this tractor and that Cat Challenger. Freaking awesome. This thing is amazing. Like, super, super cool. And it's got all kinds of stuff. Mud guards, you can put the mud guards out. Take these things. Super, super cool. And uh, last but not least, we got this truck over here. Somebody took uh, the John Deere service truck Reaper 91111 made and uh, put a Bradford built bed on it. And this thing is sick. I mean, the rims on it. Heavy duty. And the funny part, people keep asking me to, you know, to release my F450s, and I can't right now. What's up, every model guy, like getting all mad, not wanting us to release. Same with the low boy. Like, I, we, you buy those type of models, guys. that are 3D models you can buy, and that, that's how, like, the King Ranch. That's a paid model and stuff, and uh, that's how you know you get really good looking mods. You pay for the models, and I guess this dude on Turbo Squid is like getting all mad because I figured out somebody uploaded my. Uh, my low boy to some website and then the guy I guess who made the 3d model flagged it and took it down so <laughs> I don't know kind of scared but I mean I looked at the terms of condition I mean if you pay a lot of money for a model I mean it's not like I'm selling or nobody's selling the mods it's not like we're profiting off of them we're just releasing them free and letting people get it you know what I mean but yeah guys, I got the truck over here, this thing's awesome, it's got the warning lights, it's gonna be my hauler. And another thing too is like, all you really have to do is like, this thing could be an F450. Like, if I just took the badges and put a 4 instead of 3, it'd be an F450, you know what I mean? It looks like an F450, you know, so I mean, all I gotta do is just add some fender flares, because a lot of those F450s, the only difference is they got a fender flares on them like heavy duty looking fender flares and this thing I could put a four instead of a three and then boom at 450 but uh but yeah guys that's gonna be it I, I, I want to know guys how do you work that tow truck is that what am I doing it right do you just drag it and not let the wheels move because I mean if so I mean it's cool but I mean I, I don't know I might have to tinker with it to try to get it to be able to not drag the vehicle and, and make it to where the wheels can move because I don't like how the wheels don't move when you're towing with it but nonetheless very very great mod thank you Winston everybody go check out his website and people are saying his website isn't working not letting you download mods same with American Iron Modding they work guys trust me I've said it a million times Phoenix has said it a million times everybody said it a million times the mods are on there they work you have to sign up to their website. You can't just go in there and take the mod. You have to sign up for their website. And uh, I think with American Iron Modding, you got to go through some requirements to get to the download section. So make sure you do that, guys. They're on there. I promise you the links for Winston's mods work. It's not that they don't work. Because if you click on the link that I have in the description for this truck, it's going to say you don't have access to the forum. But you do. All you gotta do is just down, you know, you just gotta do the necessary requirements and rules that it takes to sign up on any forum website. Because on a forum website, you can't post if you're not signed it up. You know what I mean? You can't get some if you're not signed up. So, alright guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Give me a huge like and a comment on this video. Please give me some comments. Spread the word of the channel. Oh my god guys, we're so close to 40k. We are so close. So spread the word of the channel. I think we only got like 800 more subs to go to 40k and then we can do the big, 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 big giveaway. And I, like I said, guys, I got the giveaway, the Logitech steering wheel, and I'm in cahoots and uh, working with the guys over at Mad Cats to get you guys a full SciTech steering wheel and joystick setup with the 28 buttons that it had, 20, no, 30 buttons. It's got 30 buttons on it. On just the joystick alone in the in the steering with four like a four hundred three hundred dollars setup, I'm gonna be able to get one for free to give back to you guys. So spread the word of the channel. Let's hit 40k, and I'll see you guys in the next video later.